why don't we go somewhere only we know? Those are the words Tom Chaplin sang to me and a couple of other thousand Keen fans last night at the Belfast Waterfront Hall. And they're a great way of introduction today to uh, Pillar 1 of the Stevenson Way. Again, this is video two this week, and as you can see, I'm a bit different. I'm not in my house coat today. Um, now I'm in my um, my three-piece suit and I'm working in my bank. We can just see our nice, uh, nice little bank building in the back as opposed to uh, my, my um, rather dodgy home office. So, uh, somewhere only we know. For me, that is something that's very critical, is something only we know, something only I know, is the inside of my own head. Only I know how I think. Every human mind is unique and individual. Every human individual speaks completely differently within their mind to how they speak outside. So in order to build any form of mental health recovery, I was constantly in battle between the me I showed to the world and the me inside, the me inside my head. This, these two things were incompatible. People talk about aligning yourself with your, your missions and your values and your purposes. I wasn't in line when it created conflict and that caused problems for, for decades. So that is a step one for my recovery is to understand, know thyself. It's an ancient bit of Greek wisdom. It's a, it's, it's a great little piece of timid noski as I think it is in Latin. In Latin. Uh, terrible pronunciation probably, but there you go. But it's know thyself and it's a subject that's been covered by loads and loads of people. Benjamin Franklin has a great quote, quote about it. It's easier to, uh, the hardest, something about like diamonds and steel are harder to know than yourself. I can't remember exactly. But again, you get the point. It's very difficult to know yourself. So what you have to do is, for me, what I had to do first was ask myself the question, who are you, Scott? What's important to you? What matters to you? Your, although I hate to say it, the old Simon Sinek, what's your why? I had to get my head around that bit first. Without getting my head around that bit, I had nothing else to build on. It was all quicksand. I needed some solid foundations. So I needed to take a long, hard look inside myself and understand what it was that made me tick. And that involved me going all the way back to my childhood and you know, ripping off all the plasters and all the sticking plasters, digging all the things I'd buried out of the, the closets, and it was hard work. It was hard work that I couldn't have done without the help that I had, but I did it. So that is stage one for the Stevenson Way. It's know thyself, it's understand who you are, and there are methods to do that. And I go through them in great detail in, in my classes and my workshops, etc. But that's where it starts today. The first pillar of it is know thyself. So if you're going to smash stigma and you're going to transform lives, you can't do that unless you know yourself. Know yourself, first step of the Stevenson way. Thank you for listening. Hope you enjoyed the nice uh, nice tie today that um, I chose for myself. Not my fiancé chose it for me. See you all tomorrow with another video. Probably a car video. Cheerio, everyone.